Hello everyone, I'm Gabby. Welcome back to a new video. Have you ever thought about the words you say to yourself? What if I told you that those words have the power to shape your entire world? I'm going to offer you a practical guide on how to use this profound power you have. So make it to watch till the end to fully understand it. Also, please subscribe and comment. It would really make my day. Okay, so have you ever noticed that sometimes when you tell yourself something, it seems to come true? Like when you say, I can do this, and then you actually do it. Or when you keep saying, I'm going to have a great day, and suddenly everything falls into place? Well, guess what? It's not just luck. It's the amazing power of words at work. Let me break it down for you. Words aren't just sounds we make with our mouths. They're like little packages of energy carrying meaning and emotions. And here's the coolest part. When you say something, your brain listens. Yep, you heard me right. Your brain is like a sponge, soaking up every word you say to yourself. Now let's talk about your subconscious mind. It's like the backstage manager of your brain, working behind the scenes to make things happen. And guess what? It's listening to everything you say too. So when you keep telling yourself you're awesome, your subconscious is like, heck yeah, you are. But if you keep saying negative stuff like, I'm no good at this, your subconscious is like, well, if you say so. Here's where it gets really interesting. Your subconscious mind doesn't know the difference between what's real and what's not. So when you keep repeating something to yourself, it starts to believe it's true. And guess what? It goes to work to make it happen. It's like having a little genie inside your head, granting your wishes. So what does this mean for you? It means you have the power to attract all the awesome stuff you want in life, just by the way you talk to yourself. Instead of saying, I can't do this, try saying, I can do anything I set my mind to. See the difference? It's like planting seeds of positivity in your mind garden and watching them grow into amazing things. Now it's your turn. I want you to close your eyes and imagine something you really want. Maybe it's becoming a star, an abundant life, or whatever you really desire. Got it. Good. Now repeat after me. I am capable, I am worthy, I am unstoppable. Keep saying it until you feel it deep in your bones. Because guess what? You are capable. You are worthy. You are unstoppable. But wait, what about those times when you catch yourself saying mean things to yourself, like I'm stupid or I'll never be good enough? Don't worry, we've all been there. But here's the secret. You can change those negative thoughts into positive ones. It just takes a little practice and a whole lot of self-love. Imagine your life as a book with each word you speak to yourself as a sentence in that book. Are you writing a story filled with adventure, triumph, and happiness? Or are you stuck in a never-ending cycle of doubt and fear? It's time to take out your pen and rewrite your story. Fill it with courage, resilience, and joy. Because you, my friend, are the author of your own destiny. Now, with the law of attraction, it's like the universe's way of saying, ask and you shall receive. The basic idea is that whatever you focus on, you attract into your life. So if you're constantly thinking about how much you want something, the universe will just make it happen. But it all starts with your thoughts and words. Gratitude is another way to manifest. When you're grateful for something you don't have yet, you're sending a powerful message to the universe. You're basically saying, hey, I'm so thankful for this amazing thing that's on its way to me. And you know what the universe does? It listens. It hears your gratitude and goes, well, if you're that grateful for it, let's make it happen sooner rather than later. So let's say you really want a new bike. Instead of just wishing for it and feeling bummed because you don't have it yet, try being genuinely grateful for it as if it's already yours. Close your eyes and feel that gratitude flowing through every part of your being. Picture yourself riding that bike, feeling the wind in your hair and the sun on your face. Can you feel it? That's the power of gratitude in action. It's your turn now. Go and manifest the life of your dreams. This wraps up today's topic. I really hope you liked this video. And if you found this helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more content, and share it with anyone who needs a positive lift in their life. Thanks again until next time. Keep dreaming, keep visualizing, and keep manifesting.